Okay. Uh, I have one last question before we leave. Someone in chat asked, since <laughs> Ashley's language is so colorful, what's each of your favorite curse words? <laughs> I don't know if we're allowed to do this, you guys. <laughs> I don't know if we're allowed to do this, y'all. Uh, First of all, you're in print. <laughs> well, let's let's do it. Why not? Uh, okay. Down the down the list, MV, what's your favorite curse word? Um, it would be the F word, but I have learned to say foop because it actually upsets my wife when I say fuck, 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 fuck okay. too much. She's, she thinks I'm upset. <laughs> Aurora, what's your favorite curse word? Yeah, I'm going to stick with fuck too because it's so versatile. <laughs> and I, I have foster children who are ADHD extremely... And I find myself muttering the F word a lot. Like, what the fuck are they doing now? <laughs> so. We have a we have a contender for favorite uh, curse word going three. Uh, Barbara. Oh, I learned one from my wife Betsy, who works for the government, the Forest Service. Um, they use frick a frack, um, and I thought that's a good one. So I, we've started using that too. Jesse. Uh, I have little kids, so I'm not allowed to, <laughs> to curse, but uh, for one of my books, Pedal the Metal, I, one of the characters is like a cursing machine, so I had to do a lot of research on really um, creative ways to use curse words um, that I'm blanking on right now, but my kids um, use egads and my stars all the time when they want to curse, so those, <laughs> at, at, the, at, at the moment, those are probably my favorite ones because uh, when a four-year-old and a seven-year-old say that, it's really funny. That's cute. All right, Ashley. I've been waiting for this question my whole life. I'm so excited about it. I would have to say that my favorite is cunt, um, partially because it has such a nice mouth feel, you know? Don't you think that cunt has a nice mouth feel? And also because the old English origin of the word is quinte, which developed into two modern English words. One is cunt and the other is quaint. So in Chaucerian English, that's what he says. Instead of he grabbed her cunt, he says he grabbed her quaint. It's wonderful. It's geeky and it's fun. And also it's really, really vile to use. It's just, 